Diamond Eyes from Techline Coatings Incorporated, the latest in anodizing technology, created through the joint efforts of Techline Coatings Incorporated and Hubie Manufacturing. Diamond Dyes combine the best properties of both colored anodizing and mil spec hard anodizing, creating an extremely wear resistant, durable, chemical and corrosion resistant material in a wide range of colors. Diamond Dyes not only converts the surface to aluminum oxide, which is normal with anodizing, but impregnates additional ceramics into the porosity of the metal. A further benefit is that no dimensional changes occur. The growth is into the part. There is no need to change tolerances, clearances, or dimensions when manufacturing the part. Diamond Eyes brings the lower cost of colored anodizing with the benefits of hard anodizing to the market. To demonstrate just how wear resistant Diamond Eye is, the following demonstration is being provided. The demonstration you're about to see makes use of a piece of 6061 aircraft quality aluminum. It is put in the chuck of a lathe and spun at 1200 RPM. We are then going to lay two files against it. The first is a flat mill bastard file. The second will be a square file. In both instances you're going to see the aluminum rapidly damaged as the teeth dig into the 6061 aluminum. Notice how quickly the aluminum is damaged and how the aluminum builds up on the teeth of the file. In this next clip we're going to take the same 6061 aluminum however it's been put through the diamond dies process in a gold color. The same files are again pressed against the part it looks like the part is being damaged. In reality, what you're seeing is the teeth of the file transferring to the diamond eyes part. While the photos are a little blurry as their files are shown to you, what you're seeing is damage to the file, not to the diamond eyes part. What looks like damage in discoloration is really the teeth from the files. In fact, you'll see sparks off of the second file. Aluminum doesn't spark, steel does. This is the damage occurring to the file. In this final clip, we're going to see what appears to be a damaged part cleaned using emery cloth and then sandpaper. You'll notice as it is rubbed against the spinning part, the color begins to change. We are actually removing the steel particles stripped from the files by the diamond dies coating. When the part ceases spinning, the operator will simply rub his thumb over the part to remove the final particles. What you will then see is simply polished diamond dyes. We're going to show in comparison the original 6061 part untreated and the damage done to it right next to the treated and diamond dyes part and all you will see is the polished gold appearance. Here you'll notice that as the materials are applied to the spinning wheel the color begins to change and then finally the thumb removes the last of the metal particles You have just seen a demonstration of how effective diamond dies is in protecting an aluminum part. If you want the best in protection, whether it be simply for an ornamental part where you do not want the color to wear off, or you're looking at a high performance application where the wear resistance and durability of diamond dies shines, you want to turn to diamond dies. There is nothing else like it. You do not want the expense, difficulty, and the dimensional changes associated with hard anodizing or the easy damage that can occur to colored anodizing. You want to use diamond dyes. Diamond dyes is only available from Techline Coatings.